because you learn something new in every job and what right. I learned in this job was how to operate a garbage truck. And the fact that Aiden yeah. was doing it as yeah, well. Yeah. Oh, it's Game of Thrones guy, I love it. This is great, <laughs> give him all the rubbish. Yeah. <laughs> is about a guy played by Aiden who's released from prison on compassionate leave to take care of a young girl played by Lauren uh, who's lost her mother and he takes her to the Midlands to try start a new life um, but unfortunately they meet these troublemakers in the Midlands um, <laughs> who kind of disrupt things hey. Come here, you're really gonna have to stop doing that you know I've been doing it since I was five I don't think I can stop now well, how about this? For every day you get through without spitting, I'll give you five books, yeah? Ten. Five. Eight. Five. Six. Five. Two. Come on. That doesn't count. I was talking to Aiden's mother after um, <laughs> I'd seen a really, uh, a really great film he did called Treacle Jr., uh, where he plays a uh, really warm, funny character. This is all news <laughs> to me, by the way. <laughs> I didn't know my mother I didn't was involved tell him this. in the... Yeah, yeah. And I, so his mother was like, um, God, it's great when he plays uh, comedic roles or warm roles. And I was like, yeah, he's really, really good. This kind of thing. So I decided to write something in that kind of vein, something warm. Um, and also I met Lauren's character. The character, Lauren's based on a young girl from my neighbourhood, cursing and spitting and uh, being very charismatic and funny. And I thought, OK, I need to put Aidan Gillen together with this kind of character and move them to the middle of Ireland. She's great. How did you find Lauren? We were very nervous about finding a young actor who could play opposite Aidan because she's in every scene. Lauren, I think, was the fourth person we saw. So we had all these kids lined out outside the door to see and she came in um, and she just nailed it. And we kind of knew straight away. So we just kind of looked at each other. So we just cancelled the, the search straight away. It's, in, uh, it's interesting to me that, you know, the other, apart from Lauren, the other two main actors are uh, Belgian and Romanian, right. which does actually quite accurately re reflect what it is like in the Irish Midlands, you know, in mm -hmm. certain, you know, especially in the service industry and stuff like yeah. that. Um, how did that come about, casting, you know, Europeans? It's very much a reflection of the shifting demographics, like Aidan said, not mm -hmm. just Dublin, but across Ireland. It's not really a big deal now if you go to the Midlands and there's a Belgian girl married to a Romanian. So, I mean, it was kind of, yeah, early on I thought, like, this would be interesting to put, to clash these Irish people and these European people together. Collecting all the bins was pretty good. That was good. We, yeah. we needed to shoot, so we were in this housing estate. We said, okay, um, we need to shoot this scene so you can all put out whatever junk you want to be collected and we'll collect your bins. <laughs> and there was kind of I think everything dead bar bodies, dead yeah. bodies and like there may have been some in there that was kind of stuff wrapped up in mattresses and jelly and all kinds of crazy shit coming out of those bins. Bye, Bye Hollywood, Hollywood Reporter. reporter. <laughs> <laughs>